Cleveland who raged against Konoha under control of Obito Sharingan. The true demon of the Fox was put on full display. But that was far from the last time we would see Kurama, as Naruto was put on the receiving end of Kurama's Yang half after Minato used Death Reaper seal on him. Yang half of Kurama you being his about evil side. And thus, throughout part one of Naruto, Naruto was constantly plagued by an evil, somewhat omnipotent being living inside of him. But Naruto being Naruto eventually fosters a relationship with Kurama. And as we work on Naruto and Kurama becoming closer, eventually becoming facsimiles of best friends, their power increases with trust. Until we got to board. When Kurama told Naruto about a new Hello, bow, this bow was called the Ariyama. Although Kurama and Naruto would collide their chakra to make a new type of energy. Since they were colliding their chakra like a nuclear reactor, their chakra was being destroyed. And that's all that Kurama was made of, the chakra. So Kurama wanted to make sure that Naruto would still be around to leave the village and be with his family, decided to expect more chopper than Naruto to burn his chopper out before Naruto ran out of his chopper. Because even though Naruto was made out of flesh and blood, if he was to destroy the entirety of his chopper, he would die. And thus in the final show of Kurama's full growth as a character, Kurama gave his life. The NFL is on EA Sports, and we are in Silicon Valley at Levi Stadium in Santa Clara. Coming up, we've got a good matchup on tap between the Jacksonville Jaguars and the San Francisco 49ers. Here now to get us started is Logan Cook, and we are underway from Santa Clara. And we're about out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Right away, here's Garoppolo to throw it. And trying to get it to Samuel, but it's intercepted. Picked off by Andre Sisko. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. So a big defensive play there on the opening drive, no less, as they make the interception and bring it back to the score. And I think that's a signal for how this defense wants to play. They want to be disruptive, and you know they're going to take some chances. And sometimes it can burn you, but right there, it paid off. Extra point by Patterson, up and good. And that makes the score 7-0. So they throw the pick six to get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. Returning from his end zone is Ray Ray McLeod. And nowhere to go. He only makes it to the five. Not exactly a banner return, so he doesn't give his offense a whole lot of room to work with. They've got to go a long way now to try to score some points. I do know this from experience. There will be a few comments muttered his way by the offense as they head out on the field. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. Back here is goal line. Here's Garoppolo. Man open. That's Debo Samuel. And they'll get him down up past the 15. Here's first and ten at the 16-yard line. Just Back to Debo Samuel for consecutive catches. They'll wind up getting seven on the play, and it's second down. And you want to know, ironically, the key to Rama's reinvention is Samuel bringing in the slam. And they're able to get this one across the 35. Got it scores with 37 on first and 10. Again, they'll throw with Garoppolo. Oh, that's into a double team, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Andre Sisko. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. The Charles, it's now a two-touchdown lead in the opening quarter. Following that pick six, they are off to a fast start in this one. And absolutely ecstatic on the sideline after that play, aren't they? Not just because they got the lead, but how about seeing one of their guys get a chance to take it in for six? Already up a pair of touchdowns. They've got everything going their way early on. So they'll get another shot on offense following that pick six. And now the kick is away. Here's McLeod in his end zone. And in hindsight, 
probably should have taken a knee as he only gets this out to the 16-yard line. 49 offense have to get this drive underway. And job one here, Charles, just keep possession of football. Two drives, two turnovers to this point. You're exactly right, Dr. Ampel. I don't know if you'll be able to see the news when you keep on strong. I don't know if you'll be able to see the news. I like that. Everyone is speaking to me for a doctor. Thank you, Dr. Ampel. One second and very short. Garoppolo. That's how he finds Danny Gray. First catch for him on the afternoon, and it results in a first down. This is all about the U.S. And that'll be off the mark, too far out in front, and it's incomplete. They certainly did a nice job of improvising there, extending the play, hoping someone would come open downfield. They never did. Escaping the pressure right. And he will find his man, Samuel. And they're going to get this up to the field. And the coverage terrific there as that's knocked down and incomplete. Well, they've been back on the heels a little bit here on this drive. But the chance they see up just a little bit there with incompletion on first down. Now they have to gear up, try to get two more stops, and escape this drive. Open man is Juwan Jennings. And he is out of bounds inside the goal his first catch, good for 16 and a first. Right side and he finds Gray. And he'll be brought down at about the 23 yard line. There's Garoppolo on first and 10. That's caught by Debo Samuel. After the touchdown, it's Robbie Gold now to kick it away. From his end zone, here comes Agnew. And he's up past the 20 to the 22 yard line. Bringing the Jaguars up first and 10 at their own 22. And they'll start on the ground, ETN. And nothing much materializing there on the first down run. He'll get a couple, and that's it. From the 24, Lawrence. Looking for Jones, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Chavarius Ward. And they will finally stop him, but a great return gets that football all the way down to the 16-yard line. Well, this was a 14 nothing game not too long ago. They were looking pretty good. And then you give up the touchdown on the last drive, and now the interception. It's about to be and then trying to stay vigilant, isn't it? You have to stay on top of things. You can't relax too much, because as you noted, things change. Now they've got to go out there and get a spark going again and try and slow down this comeback. Through one quarter, 14-7 our score. If he wants to come back and turn him, George Karama says yes, and now Norah joins the entirety of Karama. Yay! But that's the thing, that when Karama was released, he had a choice as to whether or not... Second and six. No, scratch that. Second and seven. There's Garoppolo to throw. Looking for Gray and finding him once again. And just three yards on the catch there. He couldn't get away. And now we've got a third and four. Now Garoppolo. Steps away to his left. Taken down, but there's a penalty flag in the backfield. Is this a hold or did they rough the quarterback? So a critical mistake, roughing the passer. Now it's first and goal. Looking to throw, Garoppolo. And it'll be intercepted. 
picked off by Tyson Campbell. And the Jazz are going to get the football here as the ball will come out to the 20. CD, when he was a throwdown, I'm not sure if he just didn't see where the defense was. Whatever the case, not the throw you're looking for on first and goal. Not at all, because, look, let's face it, that close to the goal line is an intercept is going to hurt on any down. But really, the only down you can kind of look at is if you do it on fourth down. You know, the first three, if you don't have them wide open, just get rid of it and make sure they can't get and look to find another down. First and goal, and you throw the pick. Not good at all. Now a deep ball going to be caught here near midfield. And he's taken down right at the 45-yard line. So the big play moves him all the way across midfield. It's first and 10 from the 45. On first and 10, it's Wilkinson. And down inside the 40 about the 38. So they'll come up after the game of seven on a second and three. <laughs> Laundry on the field. This is going to be a false start on the offense. Sometimes you have to slow things down a little bit when things get heated. The cadence has to be slow and deliberate at times to make sure your team's ready to go. On second down, here's Lawrence. Now slant to Jones. And he goes down, but not before getting his inside the 25. That was good for 20 on the catch and run. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get completions, and they're taking advantage of it. Lawrence with the handoff to Robinson. The tackle there by George Odo. But sometimes you just have to give credit to the defense. And great job there for point of attack, holding up. They won their battles at the line of scrimmage, left in no space to try and run. Really nice job swarming to the ball carry. On second and nine, Morris. Oh, the ball comes out on the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. Part of what we're seeing so far is the defense is certainly coordinated. Both levels doing their jobs in tandem. The back helping them run up and running on the back. The pressure got up on that last play and forced him to try and throw through contact and short of the stick. A play fake for Robinson. Now Lawrence. And that one got him knocked away. This defense is certainly played well so far in this game. The coverage has been tight at just about every throw. Forced to see him so far in this game. And now it finds out to play down. Patterson's kick is good. And they will move up by 10 now. 17 to 7. Well, they already had the early lead and they get the interception. Charles and now they add three more with the field goal. Yeah, they're in control of how this game is playing out so far. You mentioned the early lead. Now they're spending on it. Getting plays on the side of the ground. A winning recipe if they can pick this up. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. And three interceptions in this game. And I would have to think I wasn't a quarterback, but number four is kind of oh, like, oh man, that's so. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Picked up by Andre Cisco. And the return here will go to the 31 yard line. Line of scrimmage in the 31 now on first and 10. A give left side to Robinson. And he's going to get this one down to the 30. The 49ers now going to use the All right, I'm done time. playing. As he'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Here's Lawrence to throw. A hit as he throws there incomplete. The turnover put in a great out. field position. They don't want to squander it with third down coming up. No, not at all. And you know what else you did? You make your defense mad. Yeah. They got you the football. Gave you a great opportunity. You got to cash in and get some points. And he'll be stopped at the 27-yard line, well short of the first down marker. Now a second timeout called for by the defense as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. Patterson's kick is good, and that will open the lead up now to 20-7. to seven. So the interception set him up with terrific field position, but three points, the end result. Yeah, we can make this one pretty simple, Parker. You always want to end drives with points, but that's one that you're going to look back on and probably say we should have done better there. The 49er offense set to get this drive underway. 
And for this offense, Charles, you got to think kind of crucial here to put something together on this drive because remember last time out, they threw the interception on the very first play. And you can't afford to let this defense keep building any more momentum. They're playing awfully well and they're awfully confident right now. To me, it's time to attack and take some of that momentum back. But make sure you're selective in doing so. Understand where you want to throw the football and make sure it's open before the ball hits your hands. Now Garoppolo is in trouble, and down he goes. Fight, fight, fight. A loss of 13 yards. 21, 21. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. That's going to be caught along the sideline. What a job of keeping his feet in bounds. They say that's a catch. A real letdown defensively. That was third and a bundle, but they allow the conversion. Garoppolo now, first down throw. And he'll be hit as he releases it, and that'll fall incomplete. I hate to say it, Charles, but the way that he has played in this first half, you just kind of hold your breath every time he drops back to pass. Yeah, you might be holding your breath, but those guys on the defensive side of the ball, they've got big smiles on their faces. He's handing out picks. Like the people just leave the candy out at Halloween, and you take what you want. They're having a blast out there playing against him today. From their own 40 to the other 40, the gain of 20 leads to first and 10. Another interception. And the Jaguars are going to take over once again with a football at their own 20 yard line. Robinson now throwing to start the drive. He finds his man complete. That's Lawrence. And he's going to get seven out of this before being taken down at the 27. The Jaguar is going to go ahead and use their first timeout as they'll stop the clock with 26 seconds to go until halftime. Operating from the 27 now. Here's second and three. They'll keep it on the ground again here. And he'll just keep two hands on the football as he'll be taken down after a short pickup. Now the defense will burn their third and final timeout. And with halftime on the horizon, they'll be out of timeouts from here forward. And he's set out there on third and one. Once again, they'll keep it on the ground. And he's going to have a first down, but not sure it'll matter as the clock will continue to run. Now another timeout called for by the offense. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward halftime. Now Lawrence on first down. And down he goes. The 49ers get there. Dre Greenlaw getting home on that one. And that'll do it for the end of the second quarter. This is the NFL, and it's on EA Sports. Complete on the deep ball. 
He took a shot there, but boy, was that ill advised from my viewpoint. Coverage was awfully tight. How did he get away? But that would not be a picked off. Second down and a run by Robinson. And only able to get two here. Stopped at the 30. In need of a conversion on third down. They had the big play to start the drive. Not much sense. On the slant, he'll get it to Jones. And he'll be stopped at the 27-yard line, well short of the first down marker. Riley Patterson now on for the field goal. This from 44 yards out, left hash. Patterson's kick is good, and that will extend their lead even further. Well, they picked up right where they left off in the first half. First drive after the break, they come away with three and increase that lead. Yeah, and you just want to keep building on that lead, don't you? Whether it's six points or three points, take everything you can get, keep maneuvering, keep adding to it, and keep making it difficult for them to come back. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. The San Francisco offense ready to start their next drive. Garoppolo on first down. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. Second and ten here as we roll along in quarter number three from Santa Clara. Garoppolo looks to throw. And now he has another interception. Picked up by Andre Sisko. And he will take this one home. <laughs> you quit or don't quit? Don't quit. <laughs>